This is an overview of what I'm going to talk about. Um, so I'm going to give a brief introduction on just why is energy important. I'm going to talk a little bit about our context here in Hawaii. Uh, and then I'm going to tell you about a few specific things that are going on um, and why that matters. Um, you'll also see uh, some terms at the bottom, which uh, these, these made point values, I think, really uh, reflect kind of where we need to go, but also um, they do inform our legal structures in Hawaii. So why energy? Um, I believe, and I think that this is fairly true, um, energy is the most impactful industry on the planet. Um, we fight global wars over energy. Um, we have, as Rachel was just telling us, we, we visually put uh, these polluting power plants and other infrastructure in our marginalized communities um, without them ever seeing the benefit of that. Um, and environmentally, you know, you need only look to oil spills, the hole in the ozone layer, let alone climate change, the single biggest issue facing our species right now, in my opinion, um, to see that energy is profoundly connected to so many different things that we all care about. Um, energy is also beneficial. We need it. Um, it has electrified the night. It has allowed tremendous uh, progress in, um, in the world. And I'm not going to go through all of those things because uh, we're in a fitting right here. Uh, but we need to do it in a way that does not have those same sorts of environmental and social consequences. This is kind of where we're headed right now, it seems. Um, and let's not do that. <laughs> So change is coming. Um, in a minute, I'm going to tell you a little bit briefly about uh, the history of utility, energy utility regulation. Um, but just for context, that, that system of regulation has gone on relatively unchanged for the past century. Um, unlike most other things, it has remained pretty constant. Um, but now it is at a critical point of change. And it's going to change whether we want it to or not. And it's mainly in response to two uh, big drivers. The first is disruptive technologies. Um, these include things like cheap renewables, solar, wind, uh, energy storage, energy management software, I'll use the buzzword, blockchain. Um, you know, these things are transforming the way that we do uh, everything in our life, uh, but specifically in energy. More importantly, in my opinion, is the climate crisis. Uh, I see this as an existential imperative. Our existence depends on it. Um, and this slide um, is actually a BP slide. Um, and this shows that we are, with business as usual, on track for a four degree Celsius hotter world by the end of the century. Um, and that would be catastrophic. Uh, right now, the city and county of Honolulu has just adopted some of the most uh, progressive and forward-looking uh, climate change and sea level rise guidance in the nation, probably the most. Uh, I recommend you all look at it, it just came out. Uh, but we are predicting that by the end of the century, we will have six feet of sea level rise. That's our aquifers, now with salt. That's all of our coastal zones. Um, so it's a profound issue, um, and this is something that will affect all of the work that all of us are doing. 